Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. We are back on Cubecraft Skyblock for another exciting, fun-filled episode, so let's get at it. Yep, it was a great battle. It was a, a tremendous effort, and uh, the place looks like a war zone. I, I'm not sure I, I'm not sure I'm going to do anything else with this island except maybe build a monument, because um, I did die uh, three times on this island, so that was fun. I cleared off the top here by tunneling underneath the island and locating the spawners and then uh, mining them from underneath. Then I got rid of uh, uh, most of the mobs on top, uh, the skeletons and the zombies and uh, slime I think were up here uh, by uh, uh, taking them out with a bow and arrow or even whacking them with the sword. The witches, however, I went ahead and uh, I just flushed them. I, I used water to flush them out. Uh, so they all went over the side to the void. Now down below was a little bit <laughs> even worse. I think I died twice down here. Um, so this, uh, uh, this uh, hut over here on the corner did have this uh, already down here into this underground cavern. In fact, I think uh, I think you might hear there's one witch still left down here. Uh, for the most part, I was able to flush most of them down. I think I killed one or two, um, but there's, uh, there's one witch down here that I trapped and I was like, yeah, you're just gonna stay there for the rest of eternity, witch. Um, <laughs> I don't remember where, where it's at. I could probably, uh, should be able to see, oh, it's over that way. Um, yeah, I get, I still get lost under, uh, under this, <laughs> under here, the maze, and I still got a couple of ores that I'd, uh, probably ought to go ahead and think about getting out of here. I did find diamond. I did find, um, uh, some other ores, uh, emerald, and also there's lava. Yep, so we got plenty of lava now, and, uh, yes, uh, where is it? Where's it at? I thought she was over this way. Um, hmm. Don't know where it went, but uh, it's over that way, huh? I don't know how to get over there. Um, hmm. Don't know. <laughs> Anyways, let me see if I can find my way out of here now. It's uh, it's quite the rabbit maze I got down here now of uh, uh, everything. And like I said, I probably need to come down and pick up some more of these ores. I uh, probably don't need any core. Maybe iron or coal, maybe uh, iron, and maybe check once more for uh, diamonds and emeralds. And I went ahead and uh, cleared off all the trees and got some of those dark oak saplings and uh, got them planted down somewhere here on this island. Uh, let's run and take a run over here. I think they're, yeah, they're over on this side next to Acacia. In fact, I had to clear out some of the Acacia trees to make room for the dark oak. I put them kind of far apart um, because I'm worried about uh, the, the saplings. We got to get saplings out of these guys. So I put them out here, built that out a little bit more. I'll probably continue to build this out a little bit more because uh, I sure don't want to lose any any of these saplings. Um, the other problem is, is we'll go ahead and look. So <laughs> I don't know why they make it this long. We, we still got three days left. So you plant them and you have four days to wait before before you can, uh, uh, before they're ready to harvest. And you have to plant four of them like this, um, and two by two, or else they won't grow at all. So, so yeah, so I was able to get, let's see, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So I was able to get 12, 12 trees planted. And I think we've got 4,000 to get. Um, so that'll be fun. Let's go and check with our guy here to see, um, see how many we got to do. I think it's 4,000. Uh, yeah, so I got 571 done. So to get 4,000 done is, is going to take a major effort and a long time. Uh, the diamonds, so I got 33 diamonds. Woohoo. We also got the ore generators sitting down. I'll show you where those are at. And I uh, got to still do some slimes. Um, I do have the stuff to make this. I'm thinking of going ahead and just doing that. Um, 33 should be enough for that and then the sugar so I've left the uh, the skeletons in here for now um, I'm gonna go ahead and I want to complete that inferno um, yeah so we still got we still got quite a ways to go there but I'm not real too concerned about um, making a lot of progress on the 
new quest uh, since the oak tree is going to take uh, <laughs> probably a week and a half to <laughs> to get through. So I want to go ahead and clean up, uh, finish work. I want to work more on some uh, the skeleton, the skeleton, infernal skeleton quest, and see if we can get some progress on that. And oh yeah, so I put the diamond generators here. We got some more emerald generators, more gold. Yeah, the iron. I think I've got just about enough. I might, I might put another couple blocks in here. I'll have to think about that. And then coal. I've got more than enough. So, so yep. So good. Also, I've got the. Um, I still got the uh, dropper going. I need to clean that out with the uh, creepers and the. Uh, what else is going in there? Uh, creepers and pigs are are going in there now. And uh, yep, so good. Let's see. I think that's about it. I don't think I've got any other. Pro oh, oh yeah. So I put the sugar cane down over here, and the sugar cane. I think uh, it only takes. Um, hmm. I think it's uh, eighteen hours. Maybe not. I just planted this a while ago. Yeah. So it's either seventeen or eighteen hours for uh, the sugar cane to grow. So so that's good. So yeah, I just put it up next to the pumpkins here. And then put another uh, row of water in. They're 32 long, um, so it'll be. <laughs> I'm gonna get the. I'm gonna get at least these planted, and maybe put in another uh, another section over here. Um, maybe move out the cocoa beans a little bit uh, this way, and make another section for the sugar cane there. So yep, got plenty to do. I'm gonna be uh, concentrating here, like I said, on that the skeleton infernal skeleton quest and then getting some resources uh, built up I, I dug into the oak and the cobblestone quite a bit um but anyways let's go ahead and and i, I want to replenish that so i got some grinding to do there let's go ahead and see if we can get this uh we're going to make one of each darn thing here so let's just get this uh over with um, so there's a hoe or a hoe. there's a shovel there's a hoe there's an axe and that should be a pick and that should be it for that one okay so we do have one new quest there um, what's next uh, lots of diamonds yes yeah, so I got to do that one. Oh, there we go craft an enchanting table to do this, you need obsidian, a diamond, and a book. Yep, so good. So I, I do have a whole bunch of uh, lava stored up here, so we can do that, and I'll get to work on that. I think I almost remember how to make an enchanting table, but I'll probably have to look it up again, to be honest. Anyways, I'll pause here. We'll keep on the grind, and uh, we'll see. It may be, uh, may be days and days before we get this episode up, but we'll keep working. Alrighty then, it's another day here on Cubecraft Skyblock, and I got some things done. So let's first um, check in with our Skyblock shop guy, and we've got a quest here that we should be able to claim. There we go, fireproof boots and leggings. Got the hundred infernal skeletons done. There we go, got them good. So next we got the uh, still working on that one. Uh, they haven't grown yet. <laughs> I got to get going on that one. This one we can actually do. So craft and chaining table and need obsidian diamonds and book and I actually have that. And then the witches. Now that I've got the uh, skeleton one done, I can go ahead and put up the uh, witch spawners next. Um, and then we'll get uh, we'll get going on that um, but you can see I got all the stuff needed for a enchanting table the sugarcane did finally grow again and I was able to plant this whole thing back and I actually have 33 left after I made enough paper for a book um, so I might go ahead and put another row down and then maybe think about moving uh, the cocoa beans out and building that out and and on and on it goes. So, yep, so, uh, oh, the thing about it was, though, I used this uh, Fortune 5 axe to harvest the sugarcane. And when I harvested the, the run of 32 that I had here, I actually got 50 sugarcane and had only grown up one. So... I think that that fortune might work on sugarcane, which is a good thing. Um, let's go ahead and get this enchanting table done. I'm hoping that it actually gives me the um, ability to do enchants without having to go to the hub. So let's go ahead and uh, 
let's go ahead and put it down. I'm going to put it down right behind the anvil here. And yes, it does. Good. So we don't have to go to the hub anymore. It's kind of bad, though, because um, I think I said this before. Sometimes when you get the uh, server restarting message, if you go to the hub and back to your island again, it goes away and, and everything's good. But um, we'll, we'll go ahead and use this uh, enchanting table now. You can see I'm up to 84 for the enchanting level. And I don't really uh, I don't really have anything I want to enchant. I was thinking about doing uh, the starting on the uh, diamond pick um, and probably put fortune on it. Uh, but I'm not really ready to start using up my diamonds yet. So um, I think we'll hold off on that. I don't have any real big need, I don't think, uh, to enchant anything except maybe even getting st started on a diamond sword. Um, but I think we'll be good for now with what we've got. So I'll keep building up the enchanting levels, even though there's a risk I'll lose it all and it's not really uh, not really efficient way. I, I, um, you start getting to these higher levels, um, and if we get to the nether next, for instance, this Fortune 5, to put another level on it would be um, 100 experience levels, but then I also need uh, nether quartz, which we don't have access yet to, but we need 100 experience levels. So I think I'll go ahead and start building up my experience levels, and um, hopefully we'll find a good use for it. So good. Yep, so I got to get the uh, witch spawners. I've got them in here. Got all the spawners in here so i got uh, four witch spawners i'll snag those go up to top um you know i think i'm gonna have to make a couple trips up and back uh because i gotta make sure i don't have any other ones in here um i did put up two more uh, skeleton spawners that helped a lot on getting that uh infernal skeleton spawners done but i think i've got to go up to the top get the skeleton spawners, come back down, clear these out, and then go back up and put the witch spawners up, I think is how I want to do it. Just so I don't get any uh, accidental things happening. So let me pause here. We'll get that done. I'll get busy on the, um, what is that? Uh, we got to we got to collect, we got to gather, we only got to gather 10 from witches. So maybe I won't put all four of them up. And I might as well, since I'm up there, I might as well do that. And then, uh, oh, I do have, where did this one come from? Oh, this is a new one, so I gotta, I gotta do this one. Well, we can do that one right now, then, and uh, get that one out of the way. Uh, let's see, there's a helmet. Yep, thank you for that. Uh, there's boots. Thank you for that. Leggings, yep, we'll take some of those. And chest plate, we got enough for that, too. So there, good. So uh, we got uh, um, that. Was there any others that came through now? So uh, nope, it doesn't look like it there. Uh, deflect arrows back. Block with a shield to deflect. Yeah, but you get what are what are withering withering arrows? What the heck are those? I haven't even made a shield yet. I think that was um, one of these other ones in here. Yeah, right there. Hmm. Hmm. I have to think about that. Uh, craft 100,000 cookies. <laughs> but you get 2 million coins. Yeah, that one. Uh, yeah, yeah. You're gonna have to. You're gonna have to leave that one open for a while. <laughs> I think I don't. I don't think I really want to make 100,000 uh, cookies. That's probably uh, not something I'm interested in doing. So. <laughs> All right, let me uh, keep focused on getting the witches up there. I'll pause here and we'll be either be back or be on tomorrow. Well, this is a disaster. So I came up here, I got the uh, skeletons and I went to go back down. And you can see I've got a bunny down there. <laughs> I, got a, I got a creeper. Um, so I think what happened is that they saw me and they were actually able to make uh, progress over to that and fell on that and then climbed down. So now I've got a creeper sitting down here that I'm gonna have to take out one way or another and I don't have a good way of getting down there uh, other than falling and dying <laughs> and ending up somewhere else. The only thing I, I think I got going for me here is I got 22 oak planks. So I think I'm gonna build out that way and then if I can fall in the water over there then I can get a running start at the guy, or else go get my bow and arrow. I don't have my bow and arrow on me either, which is a problem. 
Uh, geez. All right. So let me uh, let me do this. I'll I'll edit out most of this, but I thought it was uh, pretty funny that. Uh, yep, I got a, a creeper buddy joining me here, and I probably should have thought about that beforehand. All right, I think I can survive this. All right, good. We survived that. I see you over there, buddy. So let's see. What is this guy? Smite four. Um, I, I'm just going to go down and get my bow and arrow and then come back up and and take him out that way. <laughs> I do not want him blowing up. Do not do not blow up on me, creeper. Uh, where's my bow? And let me just grab some more arrows. Whoa! Whoa! Thanks for that creeper. Well, I guess he hasn't didn't do all that much damage. I can fix that pretty easy, I guess. Uh, there, almost. Um, whoa! And then I died. Oh, I saved. I got saved by the water. Ooh. <laughs> what a mess! All right. I'll have to uh, do some more cleanup if I ever want to do this guy again. Uh, I'll just put this slider there. All right, so I'll pause and uh, we'll be back. So let's get at it. First off, these darn uh, dark oak. <laughs> One more day, and then that's I know we're gonna have to wait another four days because there's no way I'm getting whatever four thousand oak out of this. Uh, thing or whatever I've got left so that's still gonna be a chore I did uh, clear out the acacia the other day so I've got plenty of room to build uh, or to put more dark oak down as I get more saplings I did put the uh, the, the acacia over here in a line I just wanted to see what it looked like and uh, uh, I mean it'd make it a lot easier to get through but you're certainly not going to get enough saplings to replace what you uh, <laughs> what you use there. So, um, yep, so good. So I did get some other stuff done. We got the uh, collect the witches, uh, 10 sugar from the witches, and that was just a outright stone cold bear. I mean, it was just murder. Um, uh, so, yeah, so I got that done. Now I'm still doing uh, craft the sugar and uh we're still working our way towards the diamonds i'm uh, right now i'm working on the kill the slime so it looks like we're it says we're 40 percent there so that's good um and quick and yeah so that's the one so four thousand so i got uh, a little less than three thousand five hundred to go there so that's going to be a long-term one so yep so i did uh also i moved out the cocoa beans and so we've got some a pretty good area for sugar cane so i got one two three I've got three and a half stacks worth here that um i can harvest up and using this stone axe um gets me get the with the fortune on it gets me more so i think that's about all the sugar cane farm i'm going to do for right now when i was working on the uh, doing the witches i did uh, i was trying to use the uh, i remember i had an iron i had an iron axe with sharp four on it well it broke um it, i was just whacking at them and 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 it broke <laughs> So I'm, I've used some XP for increasing that. The thing I got to keep remembering though is for witches, it's the bow. So I up the power on the bow. After I get the X up to back up to level five, then I'll probably work on putting the bow up to another power level because that that bow is the thing for the witches. You see my balance is uh, up a little bit. Um, I think it it's not as high as it was yesterday because what I've been doing is I think I'm made the decision that once I get enough money I am going to buy the uh, diamond generators because I think that is going to be key in the future so I've been using the uh, the money that I get from the big dropper there and we'll be buying uh, diamond door generators and I think that's a probably a pretty good use 16 million a pop but uh, I'm getting um, probably three or four million a day maybe probably more than that I probably it's probably closer to six or eight I'll have to I'll have to try to keep track um, so since I just cleaned it out a little bit ago uh, we'll see what I'll, I'll wait till tomorrow before I clean that out again 
and we'll see how much we get out of it. But so that's a pretty good money maker here with just having the pigs and the creepers in there. Could probably increase it quite a bit. I've got um, got more. Uh, I thought I did. Didn't I have more? Oh, I got one creeper. All I got is one more creeper. Of course, I could always put in some skeletons or zombies. The problem is, is that being open like that, when they go by you, they're they're gonna they're gonna see you and they're gonna try to get to you. So I think I think I'm okay with what it's doing right now. Um, let's see. So yeah, so been using the uh, Calamity Coliseum over here to get slimes. Now, oops, I gotta gotta fix my sword real quick. So I've been using the um, been using this sword. Hope I got enough. Oops, not that one. This one. Um, yep, got just enough. I've been using this uh, sharp five sword, um, and then a key. Oh, I better fix <laughs> better fix my bow too. Um, grab some string here, and let's fix up this bow. So yeah, so I've got the uh, I've got uh, two slime spawners, or is it just one in here? I think I've just got one in here for now. Um, I put a trap door here that helps keeping these guys in line. And then I just put the uh, slabs, uh, every other one around the outside because I see them getting out every once in a while. I got to make sure I'm carrying a sword and a bow at all times with these uh, these slimes uh, out and about. So I can get up here and, uh, and whack them. Uh, they, they seem to be pretty accommodating at jumping up and trying to get, oops, and every once in a while they'll get up there and get me. Um, but it seems it's a little slow going. Uh, but it seems to work pretty good. I can hit them through the uh, sidewall there um, if that's what I wanted to do, but uh, for now this seems to be okay or seems to be a little bit quicker I guess if I do use the bow um, get them on fire and take them out. So yep, so I'll be uh, we'll be working on this one for a while and like I said we still gotta wait for the dark oaks to get growed up and probably gonna have to do at least uh, one more harvest on them to get enough dark oak for the challenge and the sugar cane we'll keep an eye on that um, I think uh, I think I'll be saving like I said I don't think I'm gonna be making the uh, sugar cane farm any bigger than what it is already uh, and we'll um, start harvesting and making that into sugar so that we can start getting progress and finishing up that quest. So yes, now once I get all the ones down to the smaller ones, then we just come in here and start whacking at them. Um, seems to work pretty good. And it doesn't seem like they're dying as quick as they do sometimes. So hmm. I'm sure I'm using the right sword. So yeah, so that's six percent. So <laughs> that's gonna it's gonna take a while too. So we'll keep at it and um, see what other progress we can make, and keep on the grind here, and either be back on tonight or we'll be on tomorrow. All right, I gotta be getting close. There it is finally. Thank you for that. I should. Uh, in fact, I'm gonna go ahead and whoa. <laughs> yep, get thinking ahead of myself. All right, yeah, so let me pick up um, this darn one. There we go. We'll come back and clean you guys out later. Oh, and one got out. I think what happens is they get out when they split. Um, if the split happens where they spawn outside the, uh, the walls, that's what happens. So anyways, um, <laughs> almost ready to die to the slime. So <laughs> that was good. All right, did we... Uh, did we get another quest open here or not? Uh, let's see. Um, craft some glowstone. Glowstone dust has a chance to <laughs> drop from witches. Are you serious? I know I got some. I I got 20. I need. Um, I'm pretty sure it takes four to make one glowstone. So, well, there's five. Should have shift. There we go. So there's five. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Witches stink. Cubecraft, you gotta do <laughs> you gotta do something different for witches. They they are just too hard to kill. Uh, I, yeah, that's gonna be another day-long process and 
Oh. First, I got to get him up. I got to put the spawners up there. And then I got to get him dropping down here. And then I got to get the bow out and kill him. And then if I happen to if I happen to have to go do something else, then I've got to clear this out, let him drop into the void, then put it back up. And then, all right then. Well, <laughs> well, good. What else you got for me there? Um, yep, still that one, that one, yeah. Yeah. All right. Good. So uh, I'll go ahead and pause here. I might be able to get a little bit of uh, time done to this. I got to go clean out those slimes. How much are these slime worth, anyways? Thirty-two thousand for a stack. Mm hmm. Hmm. It's kind of tempting, but um, I can't think of a good way to kill them because if you did a dropper, they're just going to split. So you'd have to do a couple levels of droppers. And without redstone, I'm not sure. I'm not sure I got a way to do that. Hmm. All right, we'll pause here and be back. All right, so I took that uh, five piece of glowstone that I had. You can see I'm already up to 48 out of 50, and I did that by just uh, making it and then uh, breaking it. <laughs> So, so that five, I, was, I used my uh, Fortune 5 pick, um, and the uh, first couple I did with the axe, I was like, oh, maybe I better do the, the pick, and I was able to just keep breaking it and, and got enough glowstone back to get up to 50. So there you go. I don't know if that's what they meant you to do, but but by gosh, that's what we got. So, anyways, what did, did we get? Another anything else? All right, so good. So we're uh, so we're down to three main quests left. Then that's good. I took a quick look through here on these side quests, and and I'm really really not not feeling <laughs> any of them. Um, we'll be able to make some progress on that tomorrow. Um, I got a. a keep uh, an eye on the diamonds and then on the sugar cane. So I think I'll just do a little bit of grinding, get some more wood, get some more uh, cobble, maybe do another round on the uh, lapis and the coal, see if we can get some experience points and we'll be back on tomorrow. All right then, uh, sorry about this. Um, yeah, so I've, I get uh, with running two uh, series at the same time, sometimes I get confused of where I'm at in each one. Uh, it turns out uh, we're ready to end up this episode. So wanted to say thanks for watching. Thanks for your support. Make sure you're hitting that like button. Please leave me any comments, questions, suggestions down below. Please tell your friends about me. And please, please subscribe. Everyone, take care and be good.